episode of Super Guy. If you can't tell where I am, I'm sitting in the airport. It is 4.35 a.m. and I have about an hour and a half until my flight takes off. Funniest thing happened to me when I'm trying to go through um, the TSA checkpoint, you know, the security. They uh, pulled me aside because of my ghost equipment. I'm not even kidding you guys. They actually literally pulled me aside because of my ghost equipment. Um, my K2 meter, they had to swipe that to make sure that it didn't have any bomb material or anything. My spirit box, they started asking me all kinds of questions about that one. I was laughing my butt off because the look on these people's faces when they were taking out, taking out all my video equipment, you know, my camera equipment, my, my laptop, and then they get to all my spirit box stuff and my ghost equipment, you know, the look on their faces when I told them what each of those items were, because they knew everything else. But when it came to those items, they were like, what the hell is this? So I told them K2 meter, and they're like, what's a K2 meter? So I had to explain to them how we use the K2 meter. Then they get to my spirit box, and they're like, what is this? Is this some type of weird radio? And I just, oh, that's when I lost it. So I had to explain that one to them, too. Yeah, the uh, TSA agent said that it gave her goosebumps and that it freaked her out that I had all that stuff. That's awesome. That is absolutely awesome. Could not stop laughing about that one. But I am going to get on my flight soon and then I am, until that, not that time, I'm editing a video for you guys. I am actually editing my re my 30 minute alone challenge in the haunted mausoleum right now. So by the time you guys see this one, that one will be already out. So I hope you guys really enjoyed that one. That one was crazy. I'm not gonna lie, super crazy. But yeah, it's too early for this, and they didn't have any Red Bull except for the little baby cans. So I got stuck. I don't want my Red Bull. I cannot wait until wait, this flight's over. Thank God it's a direct flight and I'm hot. But yeah, we'll see you guys on the plane, guys. And then you get to see Kansas City with me. I think I've been back there more now in the past few months than I have when I was living there. <laughs> I'm constantly flying up there. I'm so over it. But yeah, we'll see you guys on the plane. Well, on the flight. Getting ready to take off right now.
that was one of the worst flights I think I have ever taken. That turbulence scared the crap out of me. We had to wear the seatbelts almost the whole entire time. The plane was going like this and going like this and everything else. But look it, I'm with my dad. See, daddy. But yeah, he's driving. But yeah, we're gonna stop by McDonald's, grab some breakfast real quick through the drive-through and the movers are on their way to pick up the rest stuff. So we have to brush back into uh, our hometown of Lawrence and go and meet up with the movers real quick. So that will be fun. But yeah, I'm so glad to be off that plane and to actually be on solid ground again. That, I'm telling you, I, I started just as, had a few little panic attacks there. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I just tried to focus on editing that video for you guys. I got almost the whole entire thing done. I just got like 15 minutes. I need to just run through and see if I can see it like, just the end of it. Make sure everything looks good and it's done. But yeah, let's go get some breakfast. I'm starving. It's eight, what? Eight o'clock in the morning now here. So nine o'clock in Florida, eight o'clock here. But it is a beautiful, beautiful day. Check this out. I haven't seen this in a while. Missed it, kinda. And at the same time, I did. <laughs> but yeah. See you guys in a bit. Hi, Kiki. Hi, baby. Mr. Pookie Pooks. Well, I made it to my mom and dad's house. It is complete disaster bill right now. Everything is getting packed up. The movers came early. And so, yeah, I'm trying to help them as much as I possibly can. This is Viracara's room. Looks so much different now. But yeah, this is the girls' room. The bathroom. This is my daddy's office. Oh man. And then you saw my parents' room. This is my mom and dad's room. And Mr. Pookie's underneath the bed down there. And we come this way. And my parents' living room. I love this house. Then you got more bedrooms and stuff downstairs. And then yeah, the kitchen. At least I have these memories. And I know that my mom will enjoy it too. Love her fridge. And then you come out here. And my mom had this room built on her little sunroom. But yeah, this was the kids' craft room. And then the backyard. Kansas City to help them get all their stuff down there. Um, yeah, 
driving my dad's car right now that is packed to the absolute brim. They're going to be coming down this weekend, so I'm going to get there a couple days before they do, and then, yeah, got to unpack all their stuff into their new house. <sighs> so much fun. But right now, I'm somewhere in Missouri. I have absolutely no idea in Missouri where I'm at, just somewhere on I-70 in Missouri. I think about 100 miles outside of St. Louis right now. So I've been taking some B-roll for you guys, so you guys can see my trip along with me, but in, we'll see you in the next stop, wherever that might be. go away. Rushing through my body I know that it is here to stay It's like you're my personal Illuminati I know that some might say that I am just a bad girl But if you treat me right I will be the best girl in this whole world No, I'm not gonna bite I got my hands on your body So tell me Tell me what you want me to do I can be good or be not it Because there ain't nobody love you like I Like I do 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 so tired just went in a crash I was out by 10 o'clock last night um, it is 9 30 in the morning now just now getting back on the road should be getting home in about 10 hours today we go through the really pretty parts of Tennessee and we go through Atlanta Yay. but yeah let's do this
exhausted I'm going to hit the bed I hope you guys enjoyed my travel vlog I know it's not something I normally put out but it's what I was doing for the whole entire week so it's why I wasn't uploading as much as I normally do but don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button I will see you guys in the next one uh -huh. Uh -huh.